just met someone and sold something that I had listed um, on like a yard sale type site, the punching bag. So we sold that, met them at Target. And then um, I've got the vacuum cleaner loaded up here in the van and we're gonna head over to the new house. And the goal is to do some moving, some vacuuming first of the floors. They've already been shampooed. So I'm gonna vacuum the floors now and then we're gonna get the boxes sorted out um, into their appropriate spaces. We're gonna put them in the rooms that they're gonna go in. And then um, we are going to do a little bit of unpacking of some boxes so that I can bring some boxes back to the house and finish up. Um, I am 100% through, um, through with my boxes. I don't have any more boxes, so I thought um, instead of tracking down some more, um, we could just come over and do some organizing over here and then bring some boxes back to the house. So that's what we're gonna do right now. Um, we have a long day ahead of us. We just got word that the gas won't be turned. I see you. Um, just got word that the gas will not be turned on until Monday. So we're still up in the air as to whether or not we'll be able to move in this weekend. The, that was the plan to be able to be fully moved by this weekend but now that the gas is not going to be turned on and we've been having some really cold nights um there is some electric heat in the house but not enough to heat the whole house um we have the electric fireplace that we could also bring over so depending on how cold it gets this weekend which i think it's supposed to be a little warmer this weekend than it has been we may still be able to move in, but um, that's kind of up in the air right now. I would really like to because I've already started packing so much of our kitchen and everything that it's our house that we're in now is becoming unfunctional. So we're in that strange in-between space where you're halfway moved and halfway not moved. And so you've got to figure out how to balance that. So. Anyway, that's going to be the goal. I'm going to try to get over here and do some more um, cleaning and organizing and maybe get some, um, I brought some contact paper to put down in the kitchen cabinet so maybe I can start unloading some of the kitchen stuff and make that transition um, a little smoother to where we can actually function in one house or another. So, um, we're going to go and do some work. I've got Jacob, Mason, and Maddie. I will be having Gavin later on today, so that will be another good help. Um, Jimmy is working, and so he won't be able to help out until probably around 5. Um, it's about 11 right now. And then my brother and sister-in-law are going to also probably help out with um, moving some of the bigger stuff later on today. So we've got to go out and go over to the house and clear out some space for some of the larger, more larger, more larger. Some of the larger furniture. We have already moved um, like a couch and the oversized chair and our formal dining room table and some of the bigger stuff like a curio cabinet and um, just some cat, some bookshelves and things like that. So, um, there's some definite there's some definite furniture over there that needs to be rearranged and kind of put out of the way but that's what we're gonna go do we're gonna have some sonic uh, and i was seeing this two times because me and anna went, 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 went to go get ice cream and yeah i wanted to bring it on skating i don't know we got, got it's Kegi, nice and Kegi, hot and sunny Kegi, this Kegi Huh? Can I get some right oh, I don't, I'll have to search and see if I have any. Oh my God. So we are taking a little lunch break. We have been at the house all morning and we have been working hard. We have moved boxes and furniture and I have been scrubbing cabinets with bleach and um, my hands are about to fall apart. <laughs> um, but we're all starving and thirsty so we decided to take a break. Oh, just a minute. I, Jake, I think we will sit in the shade. It's quite hot out here. Oh, good. I, I, I found these two on the ground. Oh, that's really good, Mason. Good job. Maddie wants to ride over there, so let's see. I'll have to look, baby. Get that corn dogs, one with fries and one with apples. A bacon, egg, and cheese stuff. All right, let's see. This is... Mom, what is this? A new, a if yours has apples in it, then that's Maddie. Let's see, I got Maddie apples. I got apples. Okay, switch that. Yeah, apples. 
Okay, yours. Don't forget, we need to say a blessing. Thank, Thank him for our food. By his hands, we all are fed. Give us, Lord, our daily bread. Amen. <laughs> all right. Christmas. You see Christmas? What is it? <gasps> what is it? <laughs> Christmas? What is it? <laughs> what is it? Christmas tree? I see it's way down there. It's the very bottom. I didn't think she knew. I know how to say that. Whoa, mm. look. What is that? The Pamion. Yeah. She's catching on quickly, aren't you? Yeah. <gasps> what is that? Scary. Okay guys, so we are here at Home Depot getting some more boxes. We need to be I don't know where they are. Boxes back up here. We're getting some boxes to keep on packing away. All right guys, I have been working hard. We've got almost everything packed up downstairs. You realize you have boxes? I know I haven't. I've been taking some vlogging breaks. Gavin's here, and him and he and Jacob are over there playing Xbox. Miss Maddie Bear is super duper 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 sleepy, and we are going to get her ready for bed. Hang on, hang on, low leg go. We're gonna get her jammies on, right? Right, Maddie. Okay, here you go. So I have been furiously packing up the kitchen um all of the pots and pans hi all the christmas dishes that i had stored away entirely too much stuff i just asked jimmy i said do you ever wonder when you're packing at the house why we Mom. own so much Mom. stuff it kind of went yeah it kind of went bigger yeah daddy had a little cut on his finger go his cut his cut was bigger. He cut his finger a little bit. He got always bigger. Yeah, he did. You're right. He got always bigger, old dad. You're right. Yeah, you're right. So, um, anyway, we're gonna try to get rid of some stuff as we unpack and we find that we don't have room for it. We're just gonna try to get rid of even more stuff. We've done. I think we've done pretty well with selling things and giving donating things to goodwill give me um but because we're doing such a drastic downsize as far as the size of our house goes and the amount of storage space that we have is dramatically decreased as well um we're gonna have to get um a little more brave with our um purging process a little bit more which i'm fine with it's just um it just Mom. takes a little bit of getting used to. Hang on, let's take your shoes off. Ugh. There we go. Huh? What? Miss Maddie hasn't had a nap today. Are you laying in the baby's bed? Uh -huh. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Can we take your clothes off and get ready for sleepy? Yeah. Are you a baby? <laughs> Are you crying like a baby? <laughs> oh my goodness, you're stuffed in there like a baby. <laughs> Get out. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. Oh, she's just a little baby. Oh, come here, baby. Oh, the baby sleepy. Here, let's take your clothes off, okay? I'll take your clothes off. Time for your checkup. You see your hair. Hey guys, good morning and welcome to the daily vlogs. They are back, they are back, they are back. We, okay. We are back to daily vlogging. I will be posting a daily vlog every day from here on out. We did take a short, tiny little break. Okay, baby. It's not working. No, that phone doesn't work. I'm sorry. I need so, um, yeah, I am back with daily vlogs. We have packed up the majority of the downstairs. 
Today is going to be a very big moving day for us. Although, oh, I have some donut on my lips, sorry. We had donuts this morning, guys, because. Hmm? No, you're not having a cupcake right now. Okay. <laughs> sorry. We had donuts because I have already packed up all of our bowls and silverware and everything like that. Now she's having a fit of her cupcake. So anyway, the majority of the downstairs is packed up. I have to complete packing the upstairs. We're going to be moving a lot of the larger things today. This is what the kitchen now looks like. Lots of boxes. Lots of mess pizza from last night because we didn't do any cooking. Maddie wants cupcake. That's why she's crying. This is the school room. So it is quite empty. Just random stuff laying around now. Um, bathroom's all packed up. This room's got the random stuff laying around. Here's what this looks like. And every room has random just random random stuff laying all around and that's just how it is right so a lot of you guys had mentioned when I said that I really didn't want to show you guys the mess and this is so obvious I don't know why I didn't really think about doing but like do a before and after um, video of the new house and I really feel like that's a great idea. I just was, I guess, a little self-conscious because I didn't want to show the new house that we're moving to in its the state that it was in because it was just really yucky. Lots of cleaning had to be done, carpet cleaning, painting, still lots of painting, yard work, um, just lots that needs to be done. Um, it's significantly smaller than this house, as you guys know, um, and now we've moved lots of stuff in, and it's basically just stacked up. It's just piled up, and yesterday we went and kind of organized some of that, but it's still pretty disorganized, especially after we move the load that we're getting ready to take in um, today. Yeah, we're almost done. We got it all packed up. We just got to straighten it up a little bit. Yep. Done well, up, upstairs, we've got to pack you guys' this room today. Okay. We've like, we got most of it down here, but like upstairs is really messy. Yep, upstairs is pretty bad. I watch this. You see all the stuff in here? What are you doing? Ready for this? Watch out, Mason. The force. May the force. Watch out there. Oh my goodness, Gavin. May the force be with you. <laughs> and then all the stuff goes flying. Flying out. Yep. <laughs> oh, my boys are so funny. All right, so today is a big moving day. I'm going to go upstairs and get ready for the day, and then I'm going to probably either pop in with them and take a load over and unload that or do some more packing before we get out of the house. I'm not sure exactly how the day is going to work out, but that's what the day is going to be like. And I will show you guys each little step of the way. All right, guys, we are on our way over to the new house. We have um, Jimmy's trailer completely packed to the brim and his truck is completely loaded up. And I've got the kids in the van here. We have also got Max. Yeah, I see. We also have Max in a box back there. I see, I see him. We have Max with us right now. We saw some evidence of a mouse or two. What? Yeah. And so we're bringing Max over to um, handle some of that rodent activity. <laughs> so he's going to be a really nice asset Mom, for us. What, sweetheart? Welcome. Yeah. What's here? Yeah. But Mr. Max is not um, used to being in a car. So he <laughs> scratched Jimmy up pretty good as Jimmy was trying to bring him out and put him in the car. And so now what Jimmy has out? scratches all over him pretty bad ones so that's what's going on and when we get to the house i will um give you guys a little bit of a glimpse at what it looks like all right guys here we are i'm in the new house and it is completely 
chaotic. So I'm going to show you a quick peek at the house with all the boxes and craziness all over the place. We're getting ready to go back to the old house and make another um, packing run and then we're going to be coming back over here. So I'm standing in the kitchen right now. This is what the kitchen looks like. And we painted up there. We did some gray up there. Okay, so here we are. We've got boxes everywhere. I need help. Do I need help? I need help. Not quite. Okay, this door leads out to the carport. I need help. Uh-huh. Just a minute. Okay, this is technically like a formal dining area that may be our schoolroom. I haven't made up my mind yet. All right, so then the front door is here. And then we have like a, a kitchen or like breakfast nook here. It has a little cutout from the kitchen that goes into the breakfast nook. Um, up there has a nice skylight. And then there are stairs that go down. This is a split level house. So then this is the living area has um, the brick. And I think that is a wood burning fireplace. So we're going to try to figure that out. I think it needs to be cleaned. Um, so, and then it leads out to a patio out back and a nice wooded area with some buildings in the back. So let me give you a little peek in this direction. Um, so that is what that looks like. And then the laundry room is here, right in there. This is a full um, bath shower in here um it's kind of yucky needs lots of painting on the walls sorry i'm going kind of fast because we're getting ready to leave and then um down here is going to be the boys room so here is their room which is going to be painted they're going to get bunk beds here they're going to have a nice corner desk here for their gaming and all of that good stuff. Here is their closet. Come, on. Come to the mic. I like this house. It's like, it's like. Here's Max. It's going to be quiet for you, like you're editing. <laughs> Come to the mic. He's hiding behind the door. We need to get in his litter box on our next run. Leave him open. Leave him Okay. Mom. That's cool too. Um, and then, hang on, Mason. Let me show the people, our friends, our new house real quick. Um, okay. So then you come up the stairs. And then you have the bathroom here, which will be right off the master. And it connects to the master bedroom here. It's got a nice electric heater here in the wall. Hey, Mason. And it has a beautiful skylight that needs to be replaced because it's real foggy, but there's natural light in here galore. This is the master bedroom. And we have nothing in here at the moment. Um, the master bedroom walks out onto a private deck, which is probably my most favorite part. I can spend time outside editing or sitting with coffee. We can do schoolwork out there, and I just feel like that is a nice, really nice part of this house. Um, here is the closet right here that um, Jimmy and I will share. And then there is a really nice... Um, vanity area although it looks like the light bulbs need to be replaced so here is a nice vanity area and does anyone need your other one so that's that you won't need your other one too. i know i don't know what i'm gonna do with my other vanity so this is a kind of a look at the master lots of work ahead of us are you drinking pepsi mm -hmm. okay we're, we're gonna have to just relax about the pepsi thing today mm -hmm. Yeah, because we're moving, right? <laughs> Madeline, this is Mason's room. Mason's room is packed full of stuff. Here's his closet. Here's his stuff, his room. Looks out to a nice wooded area back there. And then here is Miss Maddie's room, aka school room. Possibly we haven't made our mind up, but it is absolutely jam packed. And I will pay my room planets. You're gonna do planets in your room. Mom. What? I burped. You burped. Okay, guys, so this that's a general look at what the house looks like. I know you can't really get um, probably a really good idea of what it looks like. Um, and keep in mind that we are moving from a 
3,800 square foot home to an 1,800 square foot home. Yeah. So big jump. We're gonna have to get really, really, really creative about um, organizing. I'm gonna have to put my organizing skills to the absolute test and try to make it all work in a much smaller house. So there you go. Here's a look at our mess. You guys asked for it, so here it is. And I'll be taking you guys along as we get it organized. Mm. Are you ready to do some more work? No. No? Not at all. I'll keep on to my Xbox. <laughs> no. We're back at the house. We've got load number two. We have to move everything. What was oh, that? Yeah. Oh, oh that was you. Mind. We have to move everything um, back in. Let's see. I don't know what, we're gonna hit some button. Um, so yeah, well, Jimmy's trailer is completely filled up and we've got um, a lot of stuff in the van. So we're getting ready to unload it all. Well, we really need another man out here, but it's just us. Wish we had some help. All right, so I will see you guys inside. All right guys, so we've just finished unloading from the last load that we have. Well, not last, but our second load today from the trailer. And I'm sweating and feeling yucky. And the house is packed with furniture and boxes. And we have our work cut out for us tonight. So let me show you what it looks like. All right. Here is the kitchen. Here is the formal dining room area. And this space right in here and we just moved in the couch furniture down here with our bookshelves we have no idea how we're going to fit all the furniture in here because it's a small small space and we still have a recliner sitting back here um on the patio so uh yeah i have no idea which one is bigger which one's bigger yep I have no idea, Mason. Which one do you think is bigger? Which one is different? This one? I think I'd rather choose this one. Okay, you choose it. There's lots of leaves and woods and dirt for Mason to play in. Oh, they're bringing in the coffee table. Okay, here it comes. The boys have been such great helpers today. What is this? Uh-oh. Mom. What? Hello, everyone. All right. You're not going to believe the mess that we have in this house. I can't even walk through it. Last night was kind of a nightmare because Max, poor little Max, he cried all night. He was so upset and scared. What, baby? It's okay. Oh, my heavens. It was a big challenge major challenge so we got very little sleep um to top it all off i cannot function in this house the way it is literally so i'm gonna be here trying to make some sort of sense out of it today um oh there's stuff everywhere and i can't unload the stuff into the kitchen before i get the contact paper down because it was a little like filthy um please excuse the way i look i went to bed with a wet head so this is what i've been doing in this pantry i've been laying down contact paper and just trying to put some food in here so that we can function a little bit um i got the contact paper laid in there and there and i've got contact paper in our cups finally put away in here but that's all I've gotten done and there's tons more and I really, really, really need to unpack these boxes and put some stuff away because I can't walk through the house. Look at this guys. It's unbelievable. Like this is just a whole bunch of craziness. <sighs> yeah. So there's going to be probably another major uh, goodwill. What? Oh my gosh. And Maddie's in here putting toothpaste all over the place my love my love my love oh okay let me get something to wipe her hands down with i don't know where anything is 
Jimmy just took the boys to the other house because I'm meeting someone for um, a sale. Oh, well, he is, I guess. Hang on. Let's see. <laughs> Don't put toothpaste in your mouth, honey. That's just for brushing your teeth with water. You're not supposed to eat it. I'm overwhelmed. It's just a mess. This house is so small. I mean, technically, it's not like terribly, terribly small. There are people that are living in so much less space, but like to go from the size of a of home that we had to this and like all of the stuff that we have is just incredibly difficult to do that. So, <sighs> wish me luck. It's just, I just feel like I'm living in chaos right now. I don't really know where to start. <laughs> It'll be all right. Once I get past this initial, like, trying to get everything sorted out, it'll be kind of fun. So, wish me luck, guys. I will see you in just a little bit. Ooh, that's scary. Honey, do you want me to tie your shoe? Yes. Here, Jake. He's come untied a lot, don't worry. We are here at the Home Depot. We are gonna grab some things that we need. Oh, we're looking at all the Christmas goodies. Hey, Miss Maddie. All right, we're gonna go find a drill bit for brick so that um, we can hang our flat screen TV on the brick wall. And we also have to get some uh, wrap so that we can store some things in the building and it doesn't get damaged. And uh, just a few other things that we found that we need in our new home. So um, I haven't been vlogging a lot today because it's been another one of those days where I'm just working my tail end off trying to get things unpacked, unboxed, and. Um, so hopefully I will do, that's actually, a, oh yeah, that's a black one. So hopefully I will be able to do a little more vlogging um, very soon and I'll take you guys along with us the rest of today. It's a cloudy, very gloomy day and um, it's kind of zapping my energy because we're just so tired. But um, I'm out of the house for the first time in like two days. So it does feel good. Feels good to get out and about. Jacob's getting a black light. Change out my light charger. So it's gonna be like dark. It's gonna be like a party in there. Oh my gosh, he wants a black light in his room, but I'm not crazy hey. about that. Hey. Hey. Let me fix your little skirt. Come here. Let me fix your skirt. Let me fix your skirt. Oh, there we go. Okay, do you wanna go look at the smoke alarms phone? Whoa, hang on. Uh, the drill bits? 